Hey everyone, it's Ian Kay back again with another one for you. This time here at Church's Chicken to take a look at the returning smokehouse chicken. And this time around, it's looking to kick things up a bit with some bourbon black pepper. As you can see, it's looking as deep fried as ever and it's known for being nice and crispy on the outside while still retaining all the juiciness on the inside along with some really tasty smoky seasoning. And this time out, it looks to feature some sweetness thanks to some bourbon flavor and cracked black pepper. So I'm definitely looking forward to seeing how that's gonna go. And of course, I've got one of their world famous honey butter biscuits, always a treat here at Church's, along with a side order of jalapeno cheese bombers so i'll save that one for the very end but guys the star of the show definitely looks pretty tasty it's the bourbon black pepper smokehouse chicken here at church's chicken let's peep out this flavor here's the deal only at churches yeah they've definitely got the smokiness down with this one i had a lot of fun reviewing it the first time around and i'll make sure to link my review in the upper right hand corner of your display so guys let's get into this i'm very excited to give this a go again and there's really no easy way to eat this because it is a whole half chicken here so i'm just going to try and rip a leg Actually, some of the juiciness of that meat is coming up already there. I'm ripping up a leg and a portion of the thigh, and this thing is dripping everywhere. Let's get into it. It's the bourbon black pepper smokehouse chicken here at Church's. Mmm. Juicy and crispy. Mmm. Yeah, that smokiness is a highlight, but the sweetness that I'm getting from that light bourbon sauce on the outside is nice as well. It's very light, but the sweetness is there. And guys, the juiciness of the meat is just on point. I'm getting a little bit of sizzle in the background. It's kind of like a spiciness, probably from the pepper, I venture to guess here. But guys, very delicious. Let me give you a fast look of what's left of this leg. We'll get into a bigger piece in just a second, but I wanted you to take a look at that coating again here. Nice black pepper on the outside, guys. And as you can see, the juiciness of that meat is on point, really tasty. I dig the light sweetness of that sauce along with the black pepper, but the smokiness is really what's doing it for me. And that is the highlight because guys, it is smokehouse chicken, right? Mm. Let me chase that leg down with a quick bite of their honey butter biscuits, guys. Always a highlight here, and as you can see, nicely drenched in honey butter on the top. Always a favorite here at Church's. And yeah, I know, I always say it's a favorite here at Church's because, guys, it is. It's just delicious. Crispy on the outside, nice and flavorful thanks to a nice heaping portion of that honey butter and nice and dense on the inside, guys. Very delicious on this one. All right, now let's get into some dark meat loving with a bite of the thigh. Mmm. Oh man, so good. The initial crunch of that skin on the outside, the light sweetness that I'm getting, and then the black pepper with a little bit of the spice, and then a lot of the juiciness on the inside. Guys, this is easily a signature over here at Church's, and they really gotta keep this on the menu year round because it's easily worth it. I mean, five bucks for half a chicken, a side, and a biscuit. Any way you do the math on that one, that is a pretty solid deal, and the flavor absolutely is amazing. Let me give you one more shot of this one with the crispiness of that skin on display, the black pepper you can see there, and the nice glistening of the juice off of this one, guys. Absolutely a delicious chicken over here at Church's, and one that I would easily recommend to you by far word of advice though make sure you've got plenty of napkins on hand because i've already got a problem in my car right now thanks to the juiciness of this chicken here i'm definitely gonna have to change when i get home but i think as you can see this one absolutely delivers on what they're advertising here with a slight hint of sweetness along with some spice to go with thanks to that black pepper the crispiness of that chicken is on point the juiciness is on point the value is on point so with all that said how could i not give the bourbon black pepper smokehouse chicken here at church's chicken a rock solid 10 out of 10 it's crispy it's juicy it's flavorful it delivers on the value of what you're getting for five bucks and easily guys it's just really freaking delicious so do me a favor drop some comments down below let me know what you thought of the bourbon black pepper smokehouse chicken here at church's chicken is this something that you think you'd want to try and if you've had it already do you agree make sure to make your voice heard in the comment section down below and as always this is ian k closing out another episode of peep this out and like i always say i've got brand new content every single week here on my channel so while you stay tuned for the next review coming real soon in the meantime stay frosty Hey, and you didn't think I forgot about those jalapeno cheese bombers, did you? Let's get into one real fast. Mmm. Ooh, we got some heat going. There's some nice spice in these for sure. Check this out. Spicy bits of jalapeno and creamy cheddar cheese that are encased in a nice crispy coating that's deep fried. So you know this is going to be on point, And it is. I didn't plan on rating these, but if I was gonna, I'd probably give this one like a nine, guys. This is actually really good. It's packed full of creamy cheddar cheese and those spicy bits of jalapeno are on point. You can't beat the deep fried coating on the outside. Absolutely delicious. All right, now I'm definitely back into the smokehouse chicken. But real fast, let me send a huge shout out and thanks over to Jose and his team at my local churches on Orange Grove Boulevard and in Fair Oaks Avenue. I definitely appreciate you guys over there, Jose. So keep doing what you do and thanks again. All right, guys, until next time, I'll talk to you soon.